the truth. Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Crypto David and today we are going to be talking about XTC Network. Do want to say thank you guys for 2,000 subscribers. Very appreciative and thankful everyone watches, likes and comments on my videos. I will be uploading every single day of the way. Whether we are in bearish, fearful times, it's score 8 or greed, bullish times, I will be uploading every single day of the process. Title of today's video is XTC is a ticking time bomb. It is true. When we move into a utility driven market, these projects will finally start to take off and we will see their true value. So let me go further into that concept, talk about XTC news and market news. So if it's your first time to the channel, please subscribe down below and please leave a like in the video. Without further ado, here we go. Okay, so in terms of utility, as we head into a utility driven market, if a lot of these cryptos are going to fade away, we already know that Zinfinite's ISO 2022 compliant and entering a $19 trillion market only through the TFD initiative and with global trade and finance that will use XCC tokens, this should play into supply and reflect positively on the token price as well the trade finance gap which we know the gap represents a difference and is ballooned to 1.5 trillion in 2019 it is now estimated to be 3.4 trillion and is way more than that now this is an ever-growing problem day by day and xcc is going to solve this as we make the shift into a digital world because it is a digital world that we live in tweet here dennis dtcc will use xcc the r3 corda main settlement mechanism r3 use cases capital market digital assets digital identity Energy, GovTech, healthcare, insurance, real estate, supply chain, trade finance, and telecommunications. In settlements, we can see instant settlements on loans, and the DTC processes trillions of dollars of securities on a daily basis. And we know as well how huge the R3 ecosystem is, having over 300 plus firms. And Corda is probably one of the most used platforms for decentralized applications, and it uses XCC to connect private and public blockchains and we can see a lot of you know household names that we recognize here like LG, Microsoft, Oracle, Amazon Web Services, uh, HSBC, Barclays, a lot of known names here within the ecosystem. Another tweet here by CryptoKJ2, all the crypto market is saying to me is buy. Big money continues to flow into crypto. I'm getting my little money in so that it grows into big money one day. Be smart, research, empires are built patiently brick by brick. Utility projects are slow and boring to the average investor because they're not, you know, this get rich quick scheme that's, you know, short term segment that's going to pop off. These are slow processes, but when they actually pop off, they pop off. And we will see movement as we move into a utility driven market and we will see a lot of these cryptos decouple from the market. They will move ahead and that's why the majority of them are ticking time bombs. It almost feels wrong to be buying at these, you know, cheap prices. It is so cheap by now, two cents pretty much per XCC. Now let me just show you the rich list here. This is a bit outdated from April. I haven't seen a new one, but it's always good to compare. Obviously, you see these higher amounts. Do you think these people are selling out right now? Do you think these people are exiting their XCC bags? They have full belief. I can guarantee you they're accumulating while this is dipping. And with regulation, we'll see more institutional money enter the market and see these higher positions being filled up. And hopefully one day we will see these orca blue whale levels while the market is down or even, you know, dolphin, whatever these higher levels are. But the gap is going to get longer and longer as the price goes up when we return to bullish conditions as well. One chain, USDT and USDC bridges between one chain and Zinfin are now live. Fun fact, it currently costs about $19 to bridge from Ethereum to the XCC network. From one chain, it is only $0.001. It's faster too. Whenever I send my USDC or USDT, I think I use the TRC, the Tron uh, one, but it's only $1 you're taking off. But this is 0 0.001. And I have a tweet here by Bitcoin Magazine. I always see a lot of these with Bitcoin, but I like to see some within some of the products I talk about and with XCC as well. So in XCC terms, right now, the price two cents, three cents, these cent positions, any cent position, no one is interested in XCC. And then when people will be buying in, at one digit, two digit and beyond. It is a human condition, it is in every other aspect of life. If your friends are gonna go and do something, you don't even like what they're doing, but just because they're doing it, you have the fear of missing out. And this is with crypto. I've made mistakes like this before in the bull run in 2021. I you know, went into projects I heard a lot of good about, and you learn from your mistakes. You make mistakes and you move on and invest more 
when you're in fearful times. The majority of people right now are calling crypto a scam because prices are down. They are angry. They are leaving the market. They're not interested in crypto in general and especially not utility-based projects. And when it comes to substance and hype, the substance for XCC is a way above the hype. The hype is not caught up. So you are insanely early as well. FOMC mean is tomorrow. There's not enough research or crypto hasn't been long enough to dictate this is going to happen or that's going to happen. But this could definitely make or break the current market. And the second last tweet day here is by CNBC's closing bell. Brian Brooks, I want to leave you with this video. He is a very smart man. If you see him explain blockchain to Congress, he articulated it in such a way that even Congress could understand. He says here, a lot of projects you see going on here are going to go to zero. The scams, the charlatans, the easy money guys. Those people are going to get shaken out in this next six months. And you are starting to see it now 100%. And these utility-based projects are going to be the ones that rise through the ashes. Very informative video for you guys to watch. And the last tweet of the day here is by Kevin Cage. Crypto Twitter during bull markets. Tweet, good morning. Let's go. They're hyped up. Crypto Twitter during bear markets, good morning, F you. People are not happy, people are angry, especially on TikTok. But if you can you know, transmute that anger into motivation, look where you went wrong. I mean, even if you go to XDC and look at sort of like you can gauge off like the 24 hour volume, the highest points when people were investing are at these higher points, just the same as people are going to invest later on. But if you realize fearful opportunity, this is all I see. I don't see extreme fear. I just see opportunity and good buying entry points. And lastly, remember that XCC is still considered a Q coin gem. That is insane to me. Zinfinite's ISO compliant it is entering a $19 trillion market only through the TFD initiative, but it's still a Q coin gem. It is not on Binance, Coinbase. And it's always good as well to have, you know, accounts on these lower tier exchanges, even if you don't use them. Because when prices are extremely down, they won't like Binance, they won't deposit fiat or they'll, you know, cancel withdrawals when prices are up. So be sure to have a spread account on lots of these exchanges. That will be pretty much it for today's video. I do want to say thank you guys again for 2,000 subscribers. This is my mission as well, you know, re a more reassuring perspective on the market. Not delusion, but, you know, reassuring, remembering what you hold, especially in these fearful times where a lot of people are selling their bags. Have that long-term vision, reinstate, you know, what you hold, where these projects are going to go in the future and enjoy the ride. That is my mission and that is what I'm hopefully providing to you guys. If it is for another video, thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like down below and I will definitely see you guys in the next one. And I've been saying for two or three years now that in crypto, a lot of the projects you see going on here are going to go to zero. But there are Amazon.coms in there somewhere right? Things, you know, the major protocol layers, the significant network technologies, those are going to make it out here stronger than ever two years from now. But things are going to get shaken out now. The scams, the charlatans, the easy money guys, those people are going to get shaken out in the next six months. And you're starting to see that now. The truth.